फेलो स्टूडेंट्स होप आप लोग बहुत अच्छे हैं और अच्छे से पढ़ाई कर रहे हैं उम्मीद है आप लोग अच्छे से ही पढ़ाई कर रहे हैं और जो पढ़ा रहे हैं आप उसको समझ रहे हैं या समझने की कोशिश कर रहे हैं जैसे कि पिछले टॉपिक में हम लोगों ने कुछ क्वेश्चन सॉल्व किया था उसमें से एक दो क्वेश्चन में आप लोगों के लिए छोड़ दी थी उम्मीद है आप लोगों ने उसको सॉल्व कर दिया होगा क्योंकि आपके तरफ से मुझे कुछ ऐसा कमेंट नहीं आया कि आप लोग नहीं कर पाए आज हम लोग जो है एक्सरसाइज थ्री पॉइंट टू का कुछ क्वेश्चन सॉल्व करें नाउ प्लीज सी एंड टेल द एंसर अवर फर्स्ट क्वेश्चन इज राइट द एंसर ऑफ ईच ऑफ द फॉलोइंग क्वेश्चन नाउ सी हियर अवर फर्स्ट क्वेश्चन इज व्हाट इज द नेम ऑफ ऑरिजेंटल एंड द वर्टिकल लाइन्स ड्रॉन टू डिटरमाइन द पोजीशन in the cartesian plane so our answer will be what x axis and y axis respectively and the question you see what is the name of each part of the plane formed by these two lines isko hum log kya bolenge what is the name of each part of the plane formed by these two lines isko hum log kya bolenge quadrant each part jaise hi aap sunte hain each part usko hum log kya bol denge quadrant or one fourth After that, our next is write the name of the point where these two lines intersect. So, where x axis and y axis intersect is known as what? Origin. You know already. Now see, you have to see the figure and write the following. After seeing the figure, you have to write the following things. Now, just you see. Your NCERT textbook. If you have, that is okay. If you don't have, that's why I have written all the questions. You see the figure and tell. Our first question is the coordinates of B. So here you see the figure and tell. What are the coordinates of B? Coordinates of B. So our coordinates of B are what? Here, minus five and two. Is that clear? Coordinates of B is what? Minus five and two. You understand this one? Shall I repeat again? You are observing that the abscissa is minus five and the coordinate is two. Or if you are getting confused with abscissa and coordinate, directly you see it cuts the x-axis at what? Minus five and here on the y-axis at where? Two. So at that point, minus five and two. I think it's clear. Our next question is the coordinates of C. So, what are the coordinates of C? You see and tell. Here, the coordinates of C are what? Five and minus five. Please see it because here I have written and drawn everything. In other question, you have to draw all these points. Is that clear? So here, the coordinates of C are what? Five and minus five. Now you see the next question. Coordinate minus three and minus five. So see minus three and minus five. Where it is at the point E. Where it is at the point E. Can you see at this point? Now see the next question. The point identified by the coordinates two minus four. The point identified by the coordinates two minus four. So just you see where is two. Where is minus four? Please check it. Two and minus four. So this point is what our G. I think this one is very easy. Two and minus four. From the graph you can see clearly. Okay. Now let us solve the next question. The abscissa of the point D. Abscissa means what? X coordinate. Abscissa of the point D. Please check it. Abscissa of point D is what? Abscissa. Abscissa of point D is how much? Six. You can see here. Abscissa of point D is what? Six. 
six. Is that okay? Now let us see the next question. The coordinate of the point H. The coordinate of the point H. Please tell the coordinate of the point H. Coordinate. So coordinate is how much? Minus six. Now see the next one. The coordinates of the point L. The coordinates of the point L. Please see the coordinates of point L is what? Zero and five. This one is very easy. This one is how much? Zero and five. Now see the coordinates of the point M. The coordinates of the point M. Where are the coordinates of point M? Please see here. So this is what? Minus three and zero. These are the coordinates of this point. Now see, from exercise 3.2, I have solved all the questions. Now please you solve exercise 3.2. 3 as a homework. 3.2 you do as a homework. Okay, this much for today. If you will face any problem in exercise 3.3, I will solve all the problems. Till then, have a good day.